What's going on my beautiful people? Richard Harrison here with you tonight. In this video I'm going to be talking about how you can give yourself a $200 to $500 plus raise without asking your boss. Now this is very simple. The only thing you're going to do is apply the first strategy that's within my econ. And once you apply this strategy, you should see an increase in your paycheck per month. Now, I want you to understand this. This is a little disclaimer. This only works according to your situation. Okay. And what I mean only works is you may not get at that much back. It's according to how much, you know, taxes they're taking out of your check. Okay. So I just want you to understand that, you know, a lot of people think that if they're taking fifty dollars and you're supposed to get two hundred it doesn't work that way okay it all depends upon how much they're taking from you determines how much you can get back okay but what I've discovered is a little is better than you know nothing at all if it's going to help you in your situation just apply this strategy okay so the first thing you want to do is make sure you join my econ okay now, when you join my econ, you want to log into your back office. Make sure you do this. Log into your back office and go to Quick Start Orientation. Once you get there, you want to start watching this Quick Start, you know, overview. But this is the video you want to watch right here. Okay. This is the strategy that you are going to apply to correct tax withholding on your W-4 form. Now you can get that form by going to Google and typing in W-4 form 2018. Okay, you can click on this first link or either the second link here, whichever one you want. I just click on the first link and it's going to open up a new window. I'm going to close this one out. And then you're going to get this PDF form of the W-4. Now, there's two, two ways you can do this. You can download the form to your desktop and then print it off or just, you know, either print off the form here or you can download it, but at least print you about two copies so you, you know, when you go through the process the first time, then your second one will be the real one that you turn into your employer. Now, if you got your check, you know, on Friday or whenever you got paid, and you were upset because of the, the deductions or the taxes that were taken out, this can help you a great deal. And realize extra money coming back into your paycheck, you know, per month or every paycheck can help you out with eliminating debt. It can help you, you know, uh, do a lot of things that you probably can't do right now, you know. I don't, I don't want to get into detail of what some people have to do to make ends meet, but I've come to discover that waiting on a refund at the, at the end of the year or whatever, you know, doesn't work, you know, because you find yourself right back in the same situation as the year goes on, okay? So what you want to do is you want to come to this form and read this here, okay? You can always uh, just kind of scan low. Let me see if I can do something here. There we go. Okay. Now I scroll down just a little bit. Uh, now the purpose of this form, complete the form W-4 so that your employer can withhold the correct federal income tax from your pay. Consider completing a new W-4, form W-4 each year and when your personal or financial situations changes. So is you need to change this every time your financial situation changes or you know if you're married you get a divorce or you're single and you get married you know you need to make sure you adjust your W4 form okay uh if you like me before I did this back in 2017 I hadn't touched my W4 form since I started my job now I know better and so I want to show you excuse me so what you do is you just come down through here and you just follow the process. Now, you know, you fill in your name, your information, whatever, and all of that good stuff here. And then you want to come down to the second section. All right. Sorry about that. The phone wrong. So I lost my thought. 
But anyway, you're going to come down through here. And this worksheet here, this particular worksheet, you can actually type in things here, okay? Uh, here and just type in as you go what you're going to do you're simply just going to read this now understand a lot of people think that this sheet is for your dependents and things like that is not for your dependent it is for personal allowance worksheet okay a lot of people do the exempt things six months on six months off which is illegal okay a lot of people go get other children, which is illegal. We're showing you the correct way within my econ how to fill out your W-4 form. And you will, once you fill it out, you'll understand where the mistake that you made because you didn't understand how to fill it out correctly, okay? So you're just going to come down through. I'm not going to read all of this, but I'm just going to show you that you're going to enter one for yourself, you know, you just enter that number there. Uh, one, if you will file as married, filing jointly. You know, if you're married, you're going to file together. You'll put one there. You know, and if you're filing head of household, if you don't understand it, everybody, every man thinks he's head of the household when, in fact, he is not. You need to go back up here and read where it talks about uh, somewhere up in here, head of household, okay? So read this stuff as you go through it. And so you're simply just going to go down through here. Whichever one of these applies to you, it's either going to be a zero or a one or some other numbers. So just make sure you read all of this information down through here. This is the first strategy. Now, as I said in my econ, this video walks you through step by step. That's the first thing you want to do is make sure you get your W-4 form. Print your sum off and start following this video. Pause, stop, and do as it says in the video, okay? Now, here's the thing. Once you fill out this section, you are through, okay? But since you joined my econ, you are now a business owner, okay? And since you are a business owner, you get to go to another step. You get to fill out this section here because you're a business owner. Now, if you don't join my econ, you only fill out this this section here if you have a, a, a job, you know what I'm saying? But since you have a business owner, you get to fill out this section here and you will simply read and follow the instruction as in this video. Okay, step by step. Once you're done with this section, you are through. Do not mess with this here. Okay, once you're through, and it's going to show you in the video what to do, and all of that information you will bring up here and put in area number five. Okay, and that's it. You will be done. You will take this portion here, this section here, and turn it into your employer. And that's it, okay? And you just sit back and wait for your, on your next paycheck, depending upon when you turn this in, and then there should be a change in your check, okay? So as I said, once, before, once again, join my econ, okay? Let's go back to the home. When you join my econ, quick start orientation, okay? Here. Tax, go through this quick start training, but you want to get your W-4 form turned in as quickly as possible. Okay, go through that. You see it here. It's going to open up that video and just follow the video along with your W-4 form to get it filled out correctly. Okay. The next thing you want to do if when you join my econ you should get income shift pro as well okay when you get income shift pro you simply log in first thing you want to do is go here first thing you're going to do really is set up your personal info 
okay you're going to do that set up your personal info then you come here and you choose your capture page now there's going to be some more capture pages here but once you fill in your information you're good to go the only thing you really want to do then is on this home page is grab this link here and get you a domain name and redirect it or mask it to send it back to your capture pages okay that's the only thing you want to do you're good to go we have training okay we have training paid traffic sources we have ad center you have your toolbox okay e email blast autoresponder all this good information here I'm not gonna go through all that I've done a video on that before okay and you want to get signed up with that and once you get signed up with that once you get signed up with this in my econ watch that video go through this quick start training also then I'm gonna close this video out go to your account here okay and fill out the w w9 form and fill out your direct deposit okay you want to do those things you can't get paid until you fill out your w9 and until you set up your direct deposit when you get paid your money will be directly deposited into your checking or savings account into your bank account however you want that done okay so that's it for this video if you have any questions or comments just leave them down below I'm asking you to like this video share this video with somebody you know that needs this information uh, if you don't want it for yourself I want to thank all of my subscribers, all of you all who have just subscribed. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and hit the subscribe button below and uh, hit that notification bell so you'll be notified when I do other videos, okay? So with that being said, if you have any questions, my information will be below, okay? My phone number, uh, a link to join my econ will be below. As a matter of fact, it's going to lead to my system and you should see a page that looks just like this okay you can fill in your information here watch the video come down here and get started and go through the steps that's it okay and you will be good to go so with that being said I want y'all to have a great day to great night tonight and a better day tomorrow peace